you will receive a link to join the StreamYard broadcast via email. So at the at time that's been arranged with you, please go ahead and click on the link. In the display name, please type in your first name and your last name. Now let's check in the drop down box to see whether you have selected the correct camera. You may be using a built in camera, an external web camera, or you may even be using a virtual camera. So do ensure that you select the correct camera you want to use in the drop down menu. Next, let's go ahead and check your audio. Let's see if you have select selected the correct microphone input. So do check the drop down box to ensure that you have selected the correct microphone. Unless you are wearing earbuds, first prize is always to have an external microphone uh, for the best sound experience. But this is not an absolute must. That is great if you have an external one. But your earbuds should work just fine as a guest. So do ensure that you can see that. You will also have a green indicator to show that your volume is correct. And you can also adjust the volume in the event that it is too low. Next, you want to go ahead and make sure that you can hear your host. There is some really cool music there for you to just quickly do a check to see whether you can hear correctly. So please do go ahead and press on the play button. So once you've established, you can see on the indicator that your microphone is indeed working, go ahead and press on enter the studio. And now you are backstage. No one can see or hear you except the host of the show. So you can have a private chat with your host before the show starts, but the audience cannot see you and they cannot hear you. This is an opportunity to make last minute adjustments. So when it comes to camera, you want to ensure that you have front facing lighting. Do not sit with the window behind you. Do not have sharp light from behind you. You want to ensure that you have front facing light. You also want to ensure that the camera is at eye level so that you can make eye contact. If you can see your ceiling in the background, you need to make adjustments. If the walls behind you look like they're at a slant, you need to make an adjustment. The way that you can fix this is to raise your laptop to make sure that you can make eye contact with the camera. When you're looking into the camera, it means that you are looking at your hosts and the guests. Uh, people, the audience watching the show will get the sense that you are paying attention, that you are talking to them when you look into the camera. Resist the urge to look at your screen. Train your eye to look into the camera. If you must, put a picture there or a dot or something so that you can focus on the camera and make great eye contact. If you're looking into your camera and you see yourself on screen and it looks like the walls are slightly skew, it means you need to make that adjustment. And the way to do that is to, again, raise your laptop up to eye level. And then what you want to do is tilt if you're using um, the camera, the built-in camera on your on your laptop, you want to tilt your screen to a 90 degree angle. If it's at 90 degrees, you will be positioned correctly in front of the camera. Your host will guide you to ensure that you look your best on screen. But those are things that you can do yourself. So again, just remember to have front facing light. Do not have light from behind you. Or it will appear as if you are shadowed. And again, Ensure eye contact with the camera, resist the urge to look at the screen for the best possible experience. Once you and your host have now established that all is well, you are comfortable with audio, you're comfortable with the camera, and you're good to go, your host will now put you into the show. And at this point, the audience can both see you and hear you. Have a great experience.